I'm so glad all of y'all came tonight. I am really proud to be here and to see so many people that are concerned. Because it's our belief that without the turbine, without the subsidies, you wouldn't have turbines in a lot of places in Texas. You're welcome to ask that question. He asked how many people think we've been had. Okay. Here. Goldway got $850,000 a year last year out of their wind farm. How come our taxes are going up? The papers were full. You know, the papers were full. This is going to pay for new schools. Uh, new schools, I mean, to me, they come in here with just a basket full of lies. Now, for those of us that are stuck with them, I'm really concerned, Mr. Peacock, that we're about to experience the property valuation death spiral, which means if we begin seeing, as they predict, 20, 25, or 30 percent devaluation in our property, they're going to have to keep raising the rates just to stay even. We've got wind turbines about 2,000 feet from the house, and, and there is flicker and there is noise, which if anybody is within several thousand feet, they are. Now, a lot of you can still see the Milky Way up above your house. When that wind farm shows up, buddy, you won't ever see that, that Milky Way again. And I hate that it pits neighbor against neighbor, um, and it does, but I believe they know that, and it's a divide and conquer attitude and, and technique that they use. They proposed in the beginning that, oh, it caused a lot of jobs for Comanche County. I don't think anybody from Comanche County works for them. It's important to get people organized and stay in their faces. I don't care if they have closed door meetings, and you just tell them you're gonna vote them out and you need to make that happen. If you really want to, if we really want to protect our policy and our land and our heritage, then it's gonna be up to, to each one of us to honestly make the 125, 30 mile trek to Austin. We wanna make the point clear that we're not against investment in the American economy, come from what source it may but that has to be tempered by uh, input from the citizens who live there, right? So when you have a, a foreign entity, just as bad as an American entity coming in without local input, that becomes a problem, right? Y'all are not here because your voices were heard. Y'all were here because they weren't.